What's up, y'all? Welcome to episode number six. And you know, it's just my one cent. This is a special episode, y'all. It was requested by a special person. And listen, it's being brought to you by no other than I Finish Safe Sports Tops. Check out the Safe Sports Tops. Get a good look. The Safe Sports Tops, we got in three different flavors right now at our finish. Um, just check the link below. Make sure you support because, listen, we got athletes out here just sacrificing their lives during these tough times. And um, they're entertaining us. And they're out there with the purpose of caring for themselves, taking care of themselves and their family. So let's support that, y'all, as much as we can. Safe Sports Tops. Check the link below. Now listen, this episode of Just My One Cent is all about the singles. And I'm not talking about the young singles. I'm talking about you old singles. Yeah, that means... You singles, you've been through your 20s, you had all your fun, and you didn't met special people, or you might be in that situation right now with that, with that someone that you know, you should be getting on that one knee, or if you're a young lady, you know, you should be saying I do, but you want to be single. Now, most of y'all are going to look at this. What, what do you mean, I want to be single? Who want to be single? It's just that these people be tripping and, you know, dudes be wanting this. And these chicks, they, you know, they they just be wild and all they, you, nah. You want to be single. And I'll tell you why you want to be single. Everything you complain about that a woman does. Everything you complain about that a man does. Those things are never going to stop. You think you're going to get married to the perfect person. And these things aren't going to exist. You think married people right now don't have these same complaints or issues about their significant other? See, I find all these these complaints, right? Did you single people have about why you're not married yet? I find these complaints to be excuses. They're cover-ups for your insecurities and your lack of wanting to be accountable. You don't want to be accountable to another adult, but you want to pleasure her, though. You don't want to be accountable for being a father, being a husband, and everything that that, that, that endures. Them struggles, them day, them arguments about whatever the case may be. You know, them 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 nights where she's upset and she she don't want to get physical. That just that just too much for you. When 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 somebody's sick or going, you know, your significant other gets sick, oh, you're you're responsible for caring for them, getting them to the doctor, going through that that period that's not about joy, partying, pleasure. That's just that's just too much for you 
to be held accountable for. That's the real issue. You know, the responsibility of meeting in-laws. Because, see, when you get married, it's bigger than just you and that person you fell in love with. You got a responsibility to a whole nother family. And even greater than that, you're combining your family with her family. So now you got younger cousins that wasn't your cousins a year ago. Now you got uncles, you know, and, and, Mother-in-law, father-in-law, uh, you got all these combinations going on that wasn't there, didn't exist a year ago. So now, there's a bit of spotlight on you and your actions. That's what you really don't want. Oh, you want her. Mm-hmm. You want him. But... You don't want to be held accountable to everything that comes with being married. All the people that's now depending on you to uphold yourself a certain way as a man or as a woman, that's responsible to another person. That's right. Now, a lot of y'all like to say, what I got to do, I'm tired of going home alone and sleeping by myself is just not right. Well, my question is, how long you want to be single? And I'm not saying you could just walk outside today or tomorrow and you're just going to stumble on a person and you need to marry them. The ones I'm talking to, you know exactly who you are. You're sitting right next to that person or that person is just a call away that you can lock in with, but you rather play house for the rest of your life. Singles.